Hi guys, so I am just waiting in my car for someone to come out, but I just wanted to go over a couple things that um, I've been experiencing lately using the DNRS. Um, I, this is probably it's going on two and a half months and it is going great guys. I have noticed so many changes in the way I feel, the my um, the way I feel about myself, the, the way my body feels, the way I respond and react to things. It's, it's such an amazing um, journey that I'm going on with this program and I just wanted to share some of the things that I um, kind of have experienced that I've noticed changes in um, in a positive way. One thing is that I, on top of having chronic illness, I was diagnosed with POTS, GERD, um, IBS, um, you know, chronic pain, fatigue, nerve pain, um, headaches, I've had joint pains, um, a lot of pain, a lot of, um, I have POTS, a lot of digestive issues, um, just all around um, back problems, back pain, so food sensitivities, um, sound, the light sensitivities. I do have a little bit of chemical sensitivity, but it's not, it's, it's just like really, really like a small thing that I deal with, but it's still there sometimes. Um, so I really wanted to touch on basically some of the things I've noticed that have changed for me. Um, I still have symptoms right now, but I notice the way that I respond to these symptoms is a lot different. Um, and my symptoms are a lot better. I mean, they don't last as long. They come less than they were coming before. It's not as dramatic. Um, you know, I was having a lot of panic attacks and anxiety attacks, and I'm not having that. I haven't had a panic attack since I started the program. That is amazing because I was having two and three a day before. Um, so I'm just amazed with that. It's just amazing. I've also noticed like my anxiety with like checking my body, checking if I, something's wrong with me, you know, everything in my mind was like life threatening. So, cause I, you know, constantly in a fight or flight state. So I'm not doing that anymore. That is huge because I've been doing that for a year, like over a year. So my thing is that I've also noticed that I can do more. I have hope. I'm happier, I smile more, I laugh more. Life in general just feels easier. It feels smoother. And this is really big for me because I have struggled with helplessness and isolation and just always not feeling well, you know, not being in my full self. And by doing the program, I am starting to see that I, I can live a normal life again. Um, I just have to put the work in. And um, the work is not hard. The DNRS, I'm not going to get into like details of the rounds or the program, but I'm going to say that the work is very simple. It's very simplistic. Um, it's easy. It's actually something that's pleasurable to do, um, especially because the rounds, um, you know, it kind of makes you feel like you're in a, a good state of mind. It gives you a good state of mind, at least it gives me. Um, and then I'm able to feel these positive emotions again that I haven't felt in so long, um, and these positive experiences that I haven't felt in so long. So, um, I think the DNRS is an amazing program. Um, it, 
I think that it really helps people who are in a chronic fight or flight state get out of that. And it's helping me because you don't really realize that you're in this chronic state of fight or flight because you've been in it for a while. Or you don't understand it, so you get in it and you don't think that you're in it. It's very tricky. Um, so, I'm starting to see how I am in that state a lot and how to get out of it. The solution of how to get out of it. You cannot heal while you're in a survival mode. So, you have to promote parasympathetic responses and this is really good um, to do that this program helps me to do that and I just feel happier and I couldn't be happier with it it is very consistent so you need to um, you need a you need to do it for an hour a day just devote an hour you have to do it at least an hour and you know try to try to do your rounds and do them, you know, to the best of your ability. They don't have to be perfect. As long as you do them, you're rewiring your brain. So, it's it's been great. It's a, a treatment that I would not have normally wanted to try because I was so caught up in traditional medicine. But I have noticed that with the conditions that I have, personally, that traditional medicine has not been as effective for me as... Um, holistic medicine. Traditional medicine has helped. Um, like I said, I do take a low, low dose of a beta blocker still. Just, you know, to keep things even kill. Um, if I do start to get, you know, a little out of whack. But for me, I just, you know, I do my vitamins, I do my supplements, and eventually using the DNRS, I will not have to do those things anymore. And that is my goal with the DNRS is to um, just be 100% me again. I mean, no one's going to be 100%, but closer to that, not having to deal with these everyday attacks, everyday symptoms, everyday struggles, you know, not being housebound. Like, I'm not housebound anymore. I'm not, um, I'm not in a wheelchair. I can work. I go to school. Um, because of the things that I've done. Um, so it's very, it's, it, it's hard. You have to put up a little bit of a fight and you have to be willing to be uncomfortable sometimes. Um, I remember when I first got diagnosed, I was always inside, like checking my symptoms and worrying about what was wrong and all these things like oh this hurts that hurts this that I have all these things going on why is my life like this and it just fed me into this downward spiral of this like negativity and my it just it made everything worse so my advice would be to come out of that and look and say that you know there is hope that other people have healed from these conditions and there is hope you just have to be willing to do the work and sometimes the work requires you to feel uncomfortable sometimes you need to feel that uncomfortableness to get past that and to get to the next level um, that even pertains to working out say you know you're working out and in the beginning it's harder than later on and that's the DNRS too like in the beginning it's really tough you know, it's not easy because you feel bad and you have all these things going on. Your brain at least is all out of whack and then you're trying to implement something else into your routine. It's like, I can't even get out of bed. Why do I want to do this? But just do it and know that it will pay off and you can do it. You can start off in bed and then work your way up to the standing the whole time. Like... It, it can be done. If I can do it, I had so many, so many terrible, you know, things come up and I did it, you know, and I'm doing it and I have a child. I, you know, now I work, I go to school, I, you know, have a life, a family. So, um, yeah, I'll just say that and I'll end with the fact that um, if you think you can't do these things, 
that is the wrong mindset to have. Um, I would say go into it with a positive attitude and an attitude of hope and goals because you can do things that your mind tells you you can't do. You can. Your mind controls your body. So just know that and know that like mind over matter is real. So um, that's it for now. I will check back in with you guys soon and let you know some more things that are going on. Give you some more tips. And if you have any questions, you can message me below. Alright, thanks guys.